Hi everyone, it's Sean here and welcome to another episode of the Cord Family. And we are in Solani now here with uh, Isabel and Gracie and they are getting settled into their little home away from home, their little um, house switch that they did. Um, so they've, because they've just switched houses, everything is still furnished from the other family. Um, so you pretty much see that yeah, you know, obviously there's kids things in here. Um, they have brought some of their stuff from home. The boys, um, their brother, uh, Isabel's brother, dropped off some of the um, things that they'd uh, packed up from um, the mum and dad's place when they passed away, and they sold everything. So um, I'm gonna just, I've just looked at the girls' uh, work from home today. But um, they're going to look at getting new jobs and I thought maybe Isabel here, instead of being a city native, she might go change to a beach life. So we're going to switch her over to beach life. And she's going to do all these wonderful fun things and Gracie is going to, she's fine to do this, I don't mind that much, but Turinga. Uh, a new job is in order because she really wants to be a conservationist. Um, and we're going to find her a new job. Uh, Isabel is possibly going to work from home still. I still want her to stay in the politics career because I would like her to go into the uh, sort of fundraising side of it, I think it is. Oh, I can't remember what the branch is, but. Would like her to still do that, so we'll see how we go with that. I'm maybe sending her into work a bit more often than work from home, but that's okay. And she might pick up some odd jobs here and there as well. So let's go ahead and grab this conservationist career because that's definitely what uh, Gracie wants to do with her life. So I'm going to switch to that. That's okay. She doesn't really mind. Uh, she can get a jump start on her assignment, so that's really good. We'll get her to do that. And she just needs to do research conservation and she's got a laptop here so I might just go through that. She's um, applied her mud pack here, which is really good. So she's uh, putting her face clear of pimples and things like that. But uh, let's get her to research conservation. Now the girl's wedding is coming up very soon. Uh, I'm not too sure whether I calendar that event. Oh, it's love day tomorrow. What a perfect day to do it. Should we do that? Let's uh, schedule that actually. At an event. Oh no. Hang on, if I do it tomorrow it won't be gold, but that's okay. It doesn't need to be a gold event, it just needs to be a nice wedding. So we're gonna add an event. Wedding. So the wedding is all set for Friday uh, at I think about at ten. Yeah, ten AM. So Oh yeah, here you go, starts at ten AM. Uh, just a normal event because at the love day they can't have a gold event, so that's all right. We'll, uh, <laughs> that'll be really good. So we have some jobs to do. So her work from home assignment is get to know Sims in the arts quarter. So she may have to duck back to the city today mm. just to get some of those things done, and that's okay. Um, but I think we're going to get uh, Gracie off to a fly and start with her conservation career. So she's doing some research from home. We might send both girls over to the island and get them to actually have a have a look around, perhaps do a little bit of work as well. Uh, but basically I think though we might jump to somebody else's family now and uh, see what they're up to. So we are back here in Strangerville with Aaron, Alicia and Emery. And Alicia is really tense at the moment. Um, what is she trying to do? <laughs> Just need a phone call. Uh, what about Tommy's birthday today? Do you want to come celebrate? Uh, not right now. I don't know which toddler she means. So. All right, so you need to do some marching around for her job, and we're going to do that. I think march around. All right, we're going to do that. Hopefully, that'll get her to calm down a bit. And you have nothing to do there, but we do need to do 
defeat that source of infection. So that is looking like we might have to do this overnight, I think. So we're going to get him ready to go. Uh, who are his... I've got to try and remember who he asked to join him with the fight, so... I think though, we're pretty good to go. Emery is still at work apparently. He's got two hours I think to go. Alright. So Aaron... Not Aaron. Yeah, yeah Aaron. Can't remember names. Uh, okay, so he has just got something to eat and then we'll get him out and over to the secret lab. Alright, he is at the secret lab. It is a loud, noisy, and doing some rumbling. So let's go down into the basement and uh, see about taking on that mobile plant, shall we? We are here at the mother plant now, and we are going to go and fight the plant with. And this is our team that we put together. We've got Nevea, Alicia, and Emery. So let's jump on in there together, get them all here. Alright, epic battle is about to commence, we need to tell everyone to be careful and we'll try, what, no, oh, there we go, oh, uh, we need to do some more fighting of things, so we'll get uh, we've got Alicia over here, and okay, fight like those guys. Yeah. Okay, so we're only in control of one suit at the moment, obviously. So that's interesting. Oh, I can't do. I tell him to fight. You can throw vaccines. Group commands. Charge. How's it going? Oh gosh, he's probably the weakest. I'm pretty sure Alicia to uh, fight. Hang on. Emery, throw infections instead. I'll get you to it, right? Throw infection. Control stuff. Can I have another command yet? No? Okay. He's really angry. Uh, mega spray. No idea how well I'm going with this. You can fight them. There we go. And you no, can't get him to do anything. Oh, come on, guys, we can do this. Okay, um, can I get her to do anything? Okay, you, you revive Ellie and you. Oh no, this isn't going so well. Can we do it? Be careful! And charge. Alright, where are we going? Where is... Oh no! Man to fight. Uh, revive ally. We need to hit these guys down. I don't think we're going very well here. Team infection level. Uh oh, this isn't good. Oh, have we done it? Have we done it? Yes, I think we did it. Oh, expression complete. Yay! After much planning, investigation, and perhaps a bit of unconventional combat. Aaron has freed Strangerville from the clutches of the mother plant. Strangerville can now sleep safe and sound. Select a new aspiration. Alright, what should he go do? 
That was huge, so maybe we should do something else. Um, I'm thinking though he needs to settle a little bit. Maybe find a soulmate. Maybe that's what he needs to do now. Wow, wee. That was a huge fight. I can tell a story about defeating the mother plant now. Okay, that's fantastic. Okay, I think we're gonna send everyone home. That battle is complete. Alright, a little less strangerville. With one last screech, the mother plant collapses. Returning home, you notice that things are beginning to return to normal. The bizarre plants are subsiding and the infected are waking up from their nightmare. Strangerville owes you a huge debt. You are a hometown hero. You have defeated the mother plant and returned Strangerville to normal. You can return to the mother plant at any point to reawaken her. Once resurrected, you can have her set the infection level to your desired strangeness. This will allow you to replay the story with other families. Alright, well we won't worry about doing that, but... Yay! Home! Everyone's home. Alicia, where are you, darling? Oh, can I call you home? Apparently not. Aaron, I think you can retire your hazmat suit. Uh, let's change your outfit back into you every day, I guess. Alright. Well, they're all home. I think they're going to go to bed and we're going to go and wake up with the girls on their wedding day. So, so it's wedding day and the girls are just busily preparing themselves. So i uh, just going to... Get Gracie to go to the toilet. And Isabel, she is apparently off to work. That's not right. She should not be off to work. No. Yep. Come back home. Uh, no, I said come back home. Yes. Come back home, please. We had six dollars. What a day! <laughs> oh well, she went. Uh, no mail. Okay, let's get her to. What are we gonna do? I'm thinking we might actually get her to retire for now, or quit her job for now. Maybe just get her to do part time jobs and then get her to go back. Like if they decide to move back to the city, get her to go back then. So that might actually be a better option. Skiba so. Quit. Gosh. Yep. Alright. She still wants to do charity work and things, but she's actually here helping out the city uh -huh. and stuff. Oh, that's still so cute. Not the city, I mean the island, of course. Um, so, wedding day, and we are a couple of minutes away, so we'll head on over there in just a second. Alright, so everybody's here. Looks like got a lot of family, which is really good to see. And oh. Oh, okay. All right, so let's go get the ceremony on the way. We'll go down here to the end where the wedding arch is and get married. So let's get this wedding on. Okay, this might make a pretty decent shot. Oh, hang on, I might just. Pause, get headphone effects off. Nope, that didn't work. There we go, headline effects are off. Alright, let's play. I reckon it's gonna be. Oh, look at them coming down together! Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, they beautiful. Nobody's watching, which is typical. Typical Sims, hey? Typical Sims. But it's absolutely beautiful wedding. Um, I think it looks really gorgeous here on the beach. Maybe I should get some photos from the other direction. Watch a little bit from the other direction as well, because it doesn't look like anyone's coming to see it, so I may as well get some nice, pretty, pretty, pretty uh, background shots here. We'll just pause it for a second. We'll just put the roof up as well. There we go. Uh, I've got a bit 
weird, weird roof sound happening. And we've got Love Day decorations up as well, because it is Love Day, so oh, this looks pretty though. Say their vows, it's so sweet. Benfi Capuna. Oh, I love weddings in the Sims, I think they're so cute. Yay, confetti. Oh, they're beautiful. Yay, bye! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> I think there was a bit of a love day goal done as well. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Alright, let's pop down. Pop the back down again. Alright, why don't we go get some food? Have we got cake over here? I don't think we do now. So, unfortunately, my wedding glitched out to start with, so I had to redo it. Um, so, we uh, might just have to make ourselves our own white cake. Have we got another kind of wood cake? Coconut cake? Ooh! That looks cool. We could do that. Let's do that one. That must be new. That's awesome. Alright, we'll get Gracie over here. So we've got everyone's gathering around. I mean, it's just great to see everyone. We've got somebody over here. I don't know who that is. Who is that? She's just. Oh, I haven't got headline fix on. Turn that back on. Go okay, back on. <laughs> now I should be able to see who she is. Ah. Kiala. Oh, Alright, as you can see, I do have a group gathering. Just to, it was easier to get them all here, do we not? And then change all their outfits to make it work. Uh, should we dance? Or, what should we, oh, I should go with that cake. Oh no, she's busy making that. We might get... We might as well have some traditional island a drink, some kava, and uh... oh, oh, oh! Looks like we have our cake is actually made. We'll put out a water on top of that one. Um... Alright, just got a little confetti cake by the looks of That cake. Cute. Tribs. We'll see what this Eva. white cake looks like. Oh, can we call it one too? Okay, why don't we get what we got here? We'll call over onto this, I think. Might be a good idea. Oh. Is that that's a roast chicken, what's this one? Sausages and peppers. Ceviche and chips. That might be a good one to do. Alright, uh, can we call it one? Grab a serving together. That looks pretty good. I'm going to do that. I'm going to grab a serving in that one as well. I don't know whether I can call people to come and eat. No, I'm just put on the table. I was hoping I would be able to, but I can't. Why is there food on that too? Yeah, apparently so. Alright, this spells a gaining cooking skill by serving cake. Where is she? Oh, there we go. We'll add a wedding top on this one as well. We'll see which one I like best. We'll compare them. Oh, they look the same. That's a bit of a shame. I was kind of hoping they would look different. Alright. Should we... No, I should start pulling everyone to the meals. Alright, that's good. We won't worry about that one. Oh, oh my mark. Sorry about that. Alright. Where is she up to? Hmm, which is just taking in the day. Uh, not sure whether our other friendly friend guests have come on in from the city. So we do want a few other friends as well. Looks like Oh, some good angry there. Uh, no, oh, can I not do that? Okay. Let's add a topper to this one. We might be able to serve this one up. I can at least move this one where we need it. Because I can't move this one. It doesn't just let me. Mm. Huh. Sure. Alicia looks really good. They look pretty good after defeating the mother, so. 
Alright, can we... Okay. Uh, what's that? Cut wedding cake. Yay! Alright, we'll get... Get the girls in to cut their cake. Alicia, you need to start a beauty regime. Oh, looks like you're a bit spotty there, my dear. Let's follow her. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Sorry. So we're coming over here. <laughs> oh, I missed it. Never mind. Oh, I reckon it's such a cute little moment. I love that. Alright. Uh, congratulations on getting married. One of my few of our new friends saying congratulations, which is really nice. But I think that, guys, is where we are going to leave this episode today. With it, leaving it off with a wonderful wedding. We'll let these guys celebrate a bit more. And um, just enjoy Love Day as well. So thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you all next time. Bye.